Hi guys, how you doing today? Um, I wanted to talk to you today because I keep getting questions about how to start a blog and how to be successful at it. And to be honest, I don't have the answers for you. I just don't. I'm really sorry. You know, everyone has their own formula and every blog works very differently. So all I can give you are my tips for success. And this is not just for bloggers. This is for everyone. Okay? Rule number one. Believe that you can achieve. As cheesy as that sounds, believe that you can do something. I've had so many friends not do things because they can't visualize themselves doing it. You need to see yourself doing it. You know, every now and then, whenever I say that I want to do something, um, and I think it's maybe a little outlandish or something that may not be attainable, I just close my eyes and imagine myself in that position. Visualize, empower yourself. When I decided that I wanted to set out to be a model, one day I just said, I want to be a model. You know, I would close my eyes because it sounded, it seemed so crazy to me. Like, I'm a size 18, I have saddlebags, all of these things that I had told myself would hinder me from doing this. And I would just close my eyes and I would visualize myself in that position. And it worked. When you put that energy out, you will get that energy in return. Ask anyone who is successful. They will tell you the same thing. They saw themselves achieving their dreams. If I can see it, I can do it. R. Kelly. Tip number two. Talk a lot. And I don't mean in the sense, you know, I know some people, I actually know people like this, who by the time when they meet you, by the time that they're done running down their resume, you're already around, you've already turned around and started talking to someone else. And they don't even realize it because they've just been spewing out all this information about things that they've done and achievements that they have. No one really cares, you know? Have a conversation. When I meet people, I don't say, hi, my name is Kelly, I have a blog, and, you know, I'm a fashion blogger, and I, I don't run down, you know, I've been in this, I've done that, because no one cares. But when I say, hi, I'm Kelly, you know, I have a website, this is what I do for that website, um, you know, but I also do this, and I'm also looking to do this in the future. You know, you want to be vocal about the things that you are looking to achieve. Because when an opportunity arises, you're going to be at the top of someone's mind. They'll, you'll be the first person that they'll call. You know, you want to be able to vocalize your dreams. Share them with people, but don't be obnoxious about it. But be able to share them. Tip number three, utilize your resources. I'll repeat that. Utilize your resources. You have friends. You have a network. Put that energy out there. You know, say, I need a person to do this. Is anyone available? You know, tap into your friends. You asking your friends to do something will empower them. I needed a photographer. I have tons of friends who are photographers. You know, I needed a makeup artist. I have my best friend's great at doing makeup. You know, you want to tap into your resources. It will only help you. You know, I know people sometimes are scared to ask for favors or, you know, don't want to feel like they're annoying or nagging people. You have no idea who's going to be willing to help you. Okay? So, so like I said, be vocal and ask for help. Because you never know. Number four, have a plan. I cannot stress this enough. You have to have a plan. For me, I set short-term goals for myself. I have my bigger picture. And then I shot, um, I'm sorry, and then I put out short-term goals and I try to attain them so that my positivity bar is always on green. That joint is always on 100% because I am setting goals and I'm reaching them so I feel like I can reach them. You know, if I, if I set more goals and I keep reaching them, God knows what's going to happen. You know, um, that's my trick for myself because I never feel like I'm not doing something. Because you're always reaching for something. You know, whether you're trying to lose weight 
or you're looking to start a new business or you know whatever it is instead of saying I want to lose 50 pounds set yourself at a goal of 5 or 10 do things that are reasonable do things that are attainable because once you attain sky's the limit the sky is really the limit tip number five always revisit your bigger picture always you know like I said when you set those short-term goals always have your bigger picture in mind if you have some some setbacks always remember that you are trying to reach a goal whatever your bigger picture is always keep that in the back of your mind it will take you very very far if you if you're a visual person and you need to write it down somewhere you know you can put it on a whiteboard you can write it on your mirror every day you know if you need to have some affirmations that will help you remember your bigger picture do what you have to do but don't give up always remember what you're setting out to do okay tip number six be genuine People can read bullshit, and you can't bullshit bullshitters. So while you're utilizing your network, don't use people. You know, don't, don't set out to only use people. Be genuine, be a friend, you know, or you know, you can barter services or whatever it is, but just be, be real. People can tell when you are being fake. Real recognize real, as the kids say, you know, like, you just have to be genuine. You will get so far in life being a genuine person, okay? So those are my six tips for success. Um, like I said, I can't give you all of the answers. I can only tell you what has worked for me. And if you ever have any questions about anything, like I always tell you guys, you can contact me, you can email me. If you have my phone number, shoot me a text, whatever it is. I'm always here for you, okay? Um, again, my site, kellyaugustine.com. Um, it'll be at the end of the video. If you have any questions and you don't want to do all that stuff, just leave me a comment below. I'm about to head out for the weekend, so I will see you guys later. Bye!